Hello there, I'm Christian Blake. I'm Christian Blake of Christian Blake Bespoke Kitchens. We make beautiful bespoke handcrafted kitchens and furniture. We've been doing this for 25 years and um, what we're trying to do is, as everybody is aware, social media is a platform that everybody goes to these days to look for um, new things and new items and brands. And what we're doing is we're going to just give you an insight into our company week by week showing you some of the things that we do and how our company works and how we produce our beautiful bespoke kitchens. Now what we're going to do is we're going to do this every Wednesday. Uh, we're going to post one out to you every Wednesday evening and what you can do is to, um, tune in and see what we're doing. Each week we're going to start looking at different topics and all the aspects of a bespoke kitchen and what it entails. Um, let me start firstly by saying that our kitchens and all of our furniture is all made totally by us bespoke. We produce everything in our workshops and it's all made to order. So the word bespoke, a lot of people I think get a little bit confused with this and the actual meaning of it. Um, our kitchens and our furniture, like I said, is totally bespoke. So if you've got an odd size, be it uh, wonky walls, funny ceilings, um, anything, whatever it could be, the room might be very full of character and it might be in a period home, it might be anything in anywhere, any house, any property, we can make a kitchen to suit that and to suit all your needs. Now, we also, by the word bespoke, we tailor everything to what you want. We don't make or tell you that you have a certain uh, choice of what you can go with. We won't say that you can only go within these parameters. We will make everything to suit you. And um, this gives you a very big range and scope of what is possible. Anything is possible as far as we're concerned. We're not going to say, no, you can't have that because we feel as though it's not, it's not possible to make it. If you want it and we can do it, we will do it for you. So what we're going to start with is we're just going to show you the basics of how we work. What we normally do from the point of the initial getting in touch with us to the first consultation, what we do is we get your, uh, get your ideas down on paper and we get some rough sketches drawn up for you so you can see um, what you, we can see what you're talking about and uh, what you're looking for. If you've got ideas and you've got them out of magazines or you, you've got a specific design that you've got in your head you've seen nowhere else, then that's great, absolutely great. We can work with that and we can do things with it. So what we do first is we do some initial sketches for you. We do like using hand-drawn sketches for initial, um, just initial designs. Um, we also, when we've moved on from that point, we also then have the latest software. We run the AutoCAD, uh, the very latest software, so we can produce for you uh, real-time rendering pictures which will give you a very, very accurate view of what your kitchen would look like. Uh, this is very, very good for if you can't really picture it or you haven't got the, uh, you can't visualize it in your head. By doing this, we will be able to show you what it will be even before we've even turned a machine on and started cutting any timber. So we like to get all of this exactly how you want it even before we even proceed to start making anything in our workshops. Now, with all of our kitchens, we have various um, types of finishes, with from worktop surfaces to paints, to handles, hardware, anything. We have such a big range of that and we always use the best quality. Um, a lot of our products are British made, which we believe in buying British, uh, and supporting British manufacturers, uh, the quality is there. When you see the products for yourself, you will see how well they are made to other products which are made for um, in, in other countries. The, the paint finishes, we have a vast range of paint finishes. 
uh, be it from tops to dark greens to blues, um, all the different latest, all the latest ones that you can find, we have got them. And um, we won't say that we will only use a certain paint either. If you've got a specific thing that you are looking for, then we're happy to work with that. Um, so that's really covered that area. Now, what we're going to do is next week we're going to look at starting in the workshop at um, how a bespoke kitchen starts, how it goes from the sawn timber through to the finished cabinet. And um, there's various processes in that, but the reason why we want to show you each stage is because we want to show you the makeup of what goes into one of our kitchens and um, just to give you a real insight into how it's made. And a bespoke kitchen, when it's fitted, um, we believe it will give many years of enjoyment and happiness and um, like a freestanding piece of furniture, our kitchens, they're there to be admired and to um, just to, to enjoy, enjoy cooking in them, enjoy relaxing with the family, because most people today spend most of their time in a kitchen if they've got the space to do so, be it at an island or in a seating area, whatever. But um, it, it is the hub and the home, and we believe that that's the way that um, modern living is going with uh, with the way of today so we, we we produce like i say all our kitchens to suit the the family or or no matter how big it is we can we can cater for all your needs in that sense so what we'll do then is next week i'll see you in the workshop and we'll start off with looking at some timbers that we use and um, how they go from being delivered to us to manufactured into some cabinet doors and uh, so on. So thank you very much for watching. And if you do want to get in touch with us, by all means email us, um, email us, phone us, whatever, or reply on the, um, the comments bar below. And uh, we'll be happy to answer any of your questions. Please do ask questions if you have them. Uh, we will always get back to you. Um, and um, we'll see you next time. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.